Some would call it oblivious. Others would call it downright malicious. On this first day of Black History Month, the College Board announcing it's stripping several topics from an AP African American Studies course at high schools across the country. The latest move in the fight that some are against critical race theory. Here's Eyewitness News reporter Stacey Sager. For the 60 schools across the country already piloting the program and their AP students, we need classes like African American studies um, in order to like really delve in like the full depths of black history. But how different will the content of that AP course now be? The College Board announcing today a watered down version of the AP African American Studies course in which certain topics like Black Lives Matter, affirmative action, and slavery reparations are no longer part of the exam. Instead, they're listed as options for research papers. Why? Florida is where woke goes to die. A barrage of criticism from Florida Governor Ron DeSantis and the Florida Department of Education, which deemed the course, quote, contrary to Florida law and claimed, quote, it significantly lacks educational value. Because I think people want to see uh, true academics and they want to get rid of some of the uh, political window dressing that seems to accompany all this. DeSantis says he wants to take ideology out of education. Well, DeSantis is putting his ideology in. Still, this may have been an uphill battle for the College Board, with a growing number of states across the country adopting some sort of measure against critical race theory. And so the scholars who support it are now gone from this new curriculum. Not only does DeSantis want to eliminate critical race theory and Black Lives Matter, but he wants to take the warts out of history. A dangerous direction, according to many who hope to study it in the AP course. So that we can prevent anything oppressive from happening again in the future, and that's the purpose of history, and that's the purpose of why it's being taught. The timing of the announcement, also odd at best and bordering on tone deaf on this, the first day of Black History Month.